Hi, my name is Judd Laurie. I'm an interoperative neurophysiologist for Nuvasive Clinical Services. I'm based out of the Buffalo, New York region, and I service hospitals mostly between Buffalo, Rochester, and Syracuse, New York. As a neurophysiologist, I have an opportunity to work in the operating room next to the neurosurgeon, and we provide them with real-time information as to how the patient's nervous system is doing during critical care procedures, such as a spinal fusion or craniotomy for a brain tumor removal or a vascular repair. My day typically starts early in the morning. Living in the Northeast, the majority of the year, it's going to be dark. I have a long hour drive a commute to work, and uh, it gives me a great time to be quiet or to listen to some audiobooks or to just mentally prepare for my day. Once I get to the hospital and I have an opportunity to set up my equipment and meet with the OR staff, my next step is going to be to meet with the patient. And we just get their general impression of what their symptoms are, any sensory deficits or motor deficits, or if they have any comorbidities that might affect the way that that data is represented in the operating room. After we meet with the patient, then we meet with a surgeon and we discuss a game plan as to how to best cover that particular surgery. And every surgery is different and every patient's different. So we have to take our expertise in neuromonitoring and we have to advise the surgeon on what our best uh, coverage modalities are going to be for that particular case. After we meet with a surgeon, we meet with the anesthesiologist. Once the patient's sedated and under anesthesia, now it's our opportunity to work with the rest of the OR staff to get the patient prepared for surgery. So once the patient's in the room and you're ready for surgery and the patient is now positioned, now we go back to our a laptop and we collect our initial set of baseline data. On the other end of that data is an oversight physician. And the MD oversight neurologist is going to interpret the data and then we have to communicate those data signals back to the surgeon in a way that they understand exactly what's going on with the patient at that particular time. Some of the things that make a great neurophysiologist are being well-rounded, being a team player, having great communication skills, having superior knowledge of anatomy, physiology, and neurology, and also having good technical knowledge of the software and the hardware components that you use on your day-to-day. -day. Nuvasive has been an incredible company to work for, and we are always looking for high-quality staff to fill our neurophysiologist roles. Check out Nuvasive's career website because we have a number of job opportunities posted for a around the country, and if you have a strong background and good communication skills, you might find what you're looking for.